After the FOMC meeting in June, the Fed has decided to pause you know, on its interest rate increase campaign that started more than a year ago and has increased the federal funds rate by a cumulative 500 basis points. Even though the pause was expected by the markets, what was not expected was the hawkish, hawkishness of the summary of economic projections and the dot plot, which is where they see the federal funds rate in the future. According to that dot plot, the Fed is expected to increase interest rates once, but perhaps twice more by 25 basis point before the end of the year. This was a very, very hawkish statement by the Federal Reserve. And we have to remember that the Federal Reserve only controls one interest rate, the short term federal funds rate. The rest of the interest rates are set by the markets. And we believe that the Federal Reserve wasn't happy with markets pushing down longer term interest rates during the first quarter of this year. And that is the reason why they have become so hawkish. So we expect the Federal Reserve to increase interest rates once, at least once more before the end of the year, but at most twice as much uh, in order to bring the federal funds rate to 575. Furthermore, the Federal Reserve also stated that they are strongly committed to bringing down the rate of inflation to the 2% target in the long term even though there have, has been speculation that they might change that target. That is not the case. They are going to stick to 2% and they will conduct monetary policy according to the 2% rate.